We've got Pro Football Weekly's MVP meter, and Arthur, no big surprise, the top four haven't changed at all. Aaron Rodgers still number one, Tom Brady at two, Calvin Johnson at three, and Drew Brees brings it up at number four. Some pretty special guys up at the top of this, this list. Rodgers going over 110 passer rating for the sixth straight game. That's an NFL record. It's pretty good. Pretty good. Tom Brady may not have been doing much in the first 58 minutes against Dallas, but still found a way to bring him back. Looked pretty Brady-esque on that last drive. Calvin Johnson held out of the end zone, yes, still over 100 yards receiving. And Drew Brees actually did throw three interceptions, including one in the end zone at the end of that game, but over 350 yards passing for four straight games, also an NFL record. It's no wonder why these guys are at the top of the list. Brees also had to be his own head coach when Sean Payton went down. Pretty good performance from him. At number five, Fred Jackson moves up two spots, and we're just starting to see that every week he does it for the Bills. Absolutely. Fred Jackson has been astounding. Second in the NFL in rushing, averaging over 100 yards per game. He's got TDs in five straight games. He's really got the perfect blend. He doesn't just have the speed or the power. He's got it all. He's got the vision, the burst. He's really doing it all for them and uh, is really making that offense go. You could really see it all in that 80 yard touchdown run. He bursts through the hole and then weaves through defenders all the way down the field. At number nine, Frank Gore, a big game for the Niners and a big win over the Lions. He's been huge the past three weeks. I think maybe people were starting to worry a little bit. He got the huge deal and struggled in the first three weeks, only two and a half yards per carry. Last three weeks, almost eight yards per carry. TDs in the last four games. I feel like he embodies that 49er identity right now. He's just tough, gritty, determined, and uh, they're riding him and having a lot of success doing and it. And getting their money's worth right now from that big deal. And number 10, Mike Wallace makes an appearance. Quietly, he's making a ton of big plays. It's easy to be quiet when you're talking about Wes Welker, Steve Smith, both on pace to shatter the yardage record, but Wallace leading the NFL in plays over 40 yards, including five straight games with plays over 40 yards. You should just be that vertical threat, the home run threat. Now he's doing it all. He can run all the routes, and he's really been invaluable to Roethlisberger and that Steelers team. Just one of a couple of receivers on our list, and a guy that knows a little something about receivers, Jerry Rice, makes an appearance in our MVP meter this week, so check out the full article at ProFootballWeekly.com.